What's going on guys? Jimmy Vader here checking in. Uh, I got some throttle bodies that I want to talk to you about. Uh, so recently I got the Chinese 102 millimeter and then I have a boosted Nick Williams here all opened up so I can show you what makes him tick. So let's start with the Chinese one. As you can see that gear is right on the throttle shaft. It's plastic working with another plastic gear and then here's your motor. Now this one doesn't have your typical throttle position sensor like the Nick Williams does. There's a real throttle position sensor. Flat side of the, the shaft goes in there. Shows the throttle position. I'm not sure what kind of gimmick these guys are using. How do they get throttle position? Is it this, just this chip telling the ECU what the ECU wants to see? Or is it measuring uh, motor steps? Not sure, uh, somebody that is better with electronics on that can chime in. Uh, but yeah, you can see the difference here. Um, it's got this little shroud that really doesn't do much, but main difference is uh, presence of a real uh, throttle position sensor, no throttle position sensor on the Chinese throttle body. Now, here is how much slack you got on the, on the Chinese throttle body. Quite a bit of slack between the two gears. Now here's a Nick Williams, uh, less slack, aluminum gear, billet aluminum gear, real nice, uh, I must say. So I don't know if the slack contributes to any of the flutter, it probably does a little bit. Uh, I'm guessing the booster will show less flutter, will take uh, more abuse before it starts uh, throwing a code. Um, interesting thing happens when, is when we put the Nick Williams gear in the Chinese throttle body and then we have almost zero slack. So I'm going to try that before because I'm, I'm switching from the Chinese throttle body to the Nick Williams. This has thrown uh, the car in limp mode a few times. Uh, I had to do the DTC erase uh, on the fly to get to uh, normal power from reduced power. So I'm going to try this gear just for the benefit of the doubt before I throw this thing out and put the 102 millimeter uh, Nick Williams boosted one in it. Um, so uh, I'll give you an update on how that works. But let, let's, let's just for, uh, see what happens when we put this gear in that throttle body. An unbelievable amount of slack. So this gear is very loose from the Chinese throttle body. The Nick Williams gear is tighter and the combination of the Chinese throttle body and this tighter gear gives us almost no slack at all compared to a crazy amount with the Chinese gear, the Nick Williams throttle body. So I'll check back with you when I have some more results.